Matching the speed of a white water wave is very easy because the foam pushes you forward. Matching the speed of a green wave is a whole different ball game because there's nothing pushing you forward. Now it is a combination of a proper paddle technique and a new friend, gravity, that will help you get into the waves. Also, you will rarely be sitting exactly at the perfect spot between stage A and stage B. In surfing, it sometimes happens that you only need to turn around and give four to six paddle strokes to get into the wave. But in most cases, you will need to paddle out, paddle in, paddle to the side or diagonal to position yourself into the wave. You need wave reading skills to predict how waves will break, which is tricky because waves break at different speeds. When you turn around for a wave, it should be between stage A and stage B and transition into stage B as you get lifted into it. This way, you get the perfect slope to get into the wave easily.